What's up, Internet? This is the 84th Wolf, and welcome back to another episode of Wolf Watches. I apologize for my long absence yet again. I've had finals last week, this week, and I'm starting a new job, so I've been very busy, so I hope to remedy that by reviewing a whole bunch of videos, and uh, I don't know if I'll space them throughout the week, but I'll release as many as I can today, and then uh, maybe one or two throughout the week, and then Sunday go through another big chunk of things. So I'm going to be busy for the next couple days. <laughs> so, but uh, anyway, so I thought we'd start this off with uh, where we left off of Rooster Tees Camp Camp. And last one was about the mascot. Today is called Scout's Dishonor, and it's episode three. So uh, what can we expect? Well, who knows? <laughs> so far, so far, there hasn't been anything really resembling an overall plot. It's just just kind of these kids. It's it's a bunch of people sitting in the middle of nowhere just talking. And so, uh, why don't we jump right into the episode of Scouts of Honor and see what adventures our protagonists get into next. <laughs> Another wonderful day at Camp Campbell. All that's left to do now is recharge with a full eight hours of lying in bed, awake, waiting for tomorrow. Okay. <laughs> All right, guys. Our first attempt to bust out of this godforsaken hellhole didn't work. But tonight's going to be different because we have a secret weapon. Billy Nixil. Call me Snake. He's ex-Wood Scouts, and he's one of the best. Isn't that right, Billy? Ex-Wood Scouts. Got my search and rescue badge in two weeks. Got my wilderness survival in one. That's amazing. I never had a choice. He kind of sounds like the Wood Zuko. Scouts are some is of the most Dante intense Bosco? militant campers on Lake Lilac. Billy here escaped. And why is he helping us? I'm not doing this for you. I made a vow. Well, can okay. I, can let's I explain get in that? <laughs> so, what are you gonna do on the outside? Probably live with the animals. Try and get raised by wolves, maybe work my way up to Alpha, pee on stuff. What about you guys? I think I'll go to my dad's house and tell him mom sent me to an abusive summer camp. I tend to like him more so that she'll try to buy back my love. That's really dark, Neil. How about you, Max? Makes sense. Max? Billy, where are you taking us? Shortcut. Billy, are you gonna kill three kids? Ah, Jesus Christ! Did he just knife him? Go! Uh, what gives? No girls alive! Ah, Nikki! Ah, Neil, quick, grab his. <laughs> He's already oh. gone. <laughs> you never left them, did you, Billy? I made a vow to show others the glory of the Wood Scouts, and I told you to call me Snake. <laughs> Okay. I know that's tucked away. Now they're kidnapped. All right. I can stay where we can go to laugh and play and have adventures every day. I know it sounds hard to believe, but guys and gals, it's true. Camp Campbell is the place for me and you. Despite how corny it is, it's a pretty catchy tune. There's catch fish, bugs, bears, and honeybees. There's endless possibilities. And no, that's not hyperbole. Our motto's Camp ADM, and that means I'm telling you. And you have to admit, that is really impressive. Hey! Wake up! Nikki? What am I wearing? Where are we? Where happiness goes to die. Oh my god. Is that Nikki? <laughs> hey guys! <laughs> you know them? Ew, who is that? Tabby, Erin, please. A flower scout always welcomes others with daintiness and respect. Flower scouts? Okay. Nikki, you were a flower scout? Ugh, yeah. But they were totally boring, so I bailed. <clears throat> It's so good to see you again, Nikki. And, um... Nancy! Nancy? Yes! Nancy! It's, uh, it's spelled Billy Dom, it's French. Ooh, France. I'm Tabby with two eyes. Well, come on, Nancy. Our morning activities are starting. 
You can come too, Nikki. I Man, already really out. don't like these people. Hey, you think it's Max just the is voices. okay? What the? What? Why is he at a concentration camp? Why do you keep hitting me? And why is it only cloudy over your side of the lake? That's enough, Petro. <laughs> don't want to over tenderize the new me. Who the hell are you? Cedar Scout, first class, Edward Pikeman, senior patrol leader of Wood Scout Troop 818. And it looks like you're our latest recruit. God, your face is gross. What? <laughs> oh, sorry. That just slipped out. Dude, sorry. I know. That was mean. It that was really mean. was. It's just, you were so close. Enough! Enrollment into our organization has reached an all-time low, so we have no choice but to forcibly recruit new members into our program. I mean, have you considered enrollment is low because you guys do things like kidnap other campers? Oh, we don't kidnap campers. That'd He's be got a point. Overall. That guy literally stabbed me in the back. No, he rescued you after you ran away from Camp Campbell. Remember? And now we're going to make a wood scout out of you, Max. Huh. Prepare the ropes course. No! Well, I mean, he still kidnapped him, but technically he ran away from Camp Camp. Jesus Christ. Don't send this woman to camp. Send her to freaking therapy. Oh, that's nasty. Consider yourself an honorary flower scout, Nancy. Wow, Sasha, thanks. This place is amazing. Air conditioning, indoor plumbing, free Wi-Fi. The badge is actually a hotspot. Wow. I mean, what did you think this place was like? A girl can't be expected to rough it in the cruel outdoors. Amen, sister. Hey, guys, check it out. I named him Timothy. Nikki, that's incredible. Yeah. Huh? That is Nikki a big gross. bird. It probably has worms. What is wrong with y'all? But he brought gifts. <laughs> <laughs> Nancy, get away from her! What? Why? Can't you see? She's not normal. Nancy, None of I you know are you're normal. new, but you have to see that Nikki's just not Flower Scout's material. It's why we ran her out in the first place. You ran her out? Of course. It was for her own good. She's just so unladylike. She likes bugs and fighting and exercising for reasons other than sculpting the perfect body image. It's like if a boy were to come in here and try to do what we do. Whoa, 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 hold on. What the hell is that supposed to mean? Uh, hello, Nancy. Boys are supposed to be tough and rugged. And if they pee in you, you get pregnant. Whoa, Tabby, my sister told me. Look, Nancy, that's wow, just how right. the world works. Now, <laughs> Didn't do you want to be that socially to be outcast? Shown in or do you want to go get show? ice cream? Y'all are some ignorant fucking cunts. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> and the name's Neil. Let's get out of here, Nikki. Also, I'm keeping the Wi-Fi. Timothy away! <laughs> <laughs> he can pee in me anytime. Tabby, seriously, what the fuck? <laughs> She Thanks suddenly got a lot more fun. adult with the cursing. Yeah, well, <laughs> paradise isn't paradise without your friends. That was super gay. We just learned a lesson about stereotyping. Oh, right. Sorry. You think Max learned any valuable lessons on his adventure? You know, maybe I don't hate Kim Kim. Maybe I hate everything. <laughs> they can't oh, well, I mean... Makes sense. <laughs> and in his position, I think I would probably say the same thing. <laughs> All right. Well, that was a nice uh, return to camp. Uh, I haven't seen anything since uh, episode two aired. I've been like just saving it for the longest time. Just uh, and I finally have time to go through them all, and I already like it. I for I just. I guess I just kind of forgot that it's not a kid's show. There's a lot of cursing and, like, adult themes and stuff like that. And just hearing these, like, I don't even know. Like, they must be, like, 
early teens or younger and they're like <laughs> they're just cursing up a storm i forgot who wrote this <laughs> so anyway that was a good start for uh for my video viewing for today i'll bring uh, up camp camp episode three pretty soon so stick around for that until then this is ea fourth wolf and i'll see you guys next time